everybody. Welcome to today's vlog. In two hours, me and Daddy are going skiing. And my mom's mom is coming over. And I just saw a car that looks like hers. And I went outside and checked if there were any pink spray paint on the on the lights or any stickers on one of the windows and there wasn't so grandma is still coming but I really hope mommy's sister is going to be with grandma because because she she's one of our favorites good afternoon everybody welcome to today's vlog as you can see behind me We've got a mountain full of snow. I finally, after three, four years, have finally made it up here to teach this young thing over here how to ski. Audrey, are you excited? Yeah. Come look at the camera. Is this your first time learning how to ski? Yeah. Are you having fun already? We haven't even done anything yet. Our feet hurt from walking in our boots, but just had a little snack and uh, we're able to start skiing based on our tickets in about 10 minutes. So we're gonna go get our skis on and uh, teach this one how to ski and come down that mountain right there. So hopefully it'll be fun. Hopefully she takes to it like I did and has a good time. We'll see. All right, Audrey, you ready to do this? She's all ready, she's got the skis on and everything, so let's go try our hand at skiing and see if we can get some good footage too. Those ones are the one car. So we're on the ski lift now. We had a little bit of a uh, mix up when we went to the ticket office. Uh, it's been three years since I've been here at least. And uh, they didn't give me any tickets, so I figured with ski after three o'clock for $10, it used to be ski free. Figured maybe they didn't do tickets anymore. You get to the very front of the line after waiting in line for 20 minutes. No, you do need a ticket. So, thankfully, they said we could leave our ski stuff and walk over to the ticket booth. And it took them a while to find evidence that we got them. But here we are on the lift. Audrey's first time on a ski lift. What do you think? She's a little frightened, but she'll be okay. There goes a the ski right there. So we're gonna Dad. see uh, see how we can do. I'm really What's up? scared. You don't have to be scared. I'm right here. I won't let anything happen to you, okay? That guy just went off a jump. Who so we'll see be? how she does. All right, here's Audrey's first chance on her own. All right, see if you can make it to me. Keep moving a little bit. Okay, try and make the V. See, you did it, and you stopped. You slowed down. There you go. There you did it, Audrey. Good job. You know, one thing's for sure, Audrey. It's beautiful up here with all the snow in the mountains. What do you think? It's good. Is it pretty up here? Yeah, but I didn't like skiing a lot at all. You had fun though, didn't you? Yeah, but... Tell us what the the what you liked about it first um, when we were going up to the top when we were on the ski lift you thought that was pretty fun yeah tell me what you didn't like about it um, when it when it came to the 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 steep parts the, the first time when it came to the steep part and we got going too fast and crashed a few times yeah. It's a good thing you're run, wearing your helmet, huh? Yeah, but but my my head went up and some of the helmet wasn't on the back. Uh, and then when got I some fell, snow in it. And then when I fell, I banged my head on the Well, on that's the, no good. It would have felt worse if you didn't have your helmet, though. And I think that I enjoyed being with Audrey. That was my favorite part. We did have fun. Um, we only went down once but it was it was kind of difficult so i'm not a very good teacher i'm a good skier but i've realized i'm not a very good teacher so we're actually going to save up our money for the next year and put her in ski school huh yeah yeah 
I think they'll do a better job. Plus, I about blew out my knees just trying to snow plow with her. But we had a good time. So let's go show them what we put on the back of the car, Audrey. Ski like a girl. You're a girl. You think you're a good skier? No, not yet. But you're going to be, huh? Yeah. All right, so we are on our way out of the canyon. There's Audrey, Audrey hello. waving. Hello, hello, hello. Suffice it to say, we've had a good time. We're exhausted. My knees and my back hurt. Audrey's, I think she feels fine, but you know, it was a, it was a day for her. So we're just heading down the canyon and uh, we'll be home soon and see the rest of the family. It'll be fun. And there is the Salt Lake Valley. Hopefully there's not too bad of a glare out there. The thing about winter time though is it's so much cleaner up here in the mountains than down there. Although we haven't bad, had bad inversion lately. So anyway, I am exhausted. Like I said already, I'm excited to go home and just spend some time with my family and relax. So we will see you when we get home. Well, it is Sunday morning. Actually, it's Sunday afternoon. Holy cow. Daylight savings time, the day's flying by with uh, losing that extra hour. So, I already told you kind of how we're deciding that we're just going to save some money and do ski school for Audrey and for Quinn uh, next winter time because uh, I'm not a great teacher. I already said that, and that's the case. I think the biggest issue I had was I was being a little bit overprotective. I wanted to make sure that she didn't get hurt, and uh, I should have let her kind of fall down herself a few times. So that's what made my back and my knees really kill me. I almost had to sleep on the couch last night because I couldn't fall asleep, but I'm doing all right. I mean, I don't uh, have many excuses compared to the lady sitting next to me that's just waiting for this baby to come out. No new big news with that, though. It's Sunday, and... She's due to be induced on Friday, five days from now. And so as far as the baby is concerned, unless he surprises us and comes before then, we're expecting Friday. So tune in for that. It'll probably actually end up being our 100th vlog on this channel too, which is pretty cool. So with that in mind, we will keep you informed as to any updates as far as that is concerned. In the meantime, don't forget to tell those that you love that you love them. Keep a smile on your face. Ooh, that's new. I'm not going to keep saying that one, though. Make happiness go viral, and we'll see you around.